Conrad grew up feeling the stigma and shame of mental illness because for years he watched his father struggle with schizophrenia. I remember one time somebody had said something like, are you going to be like your dad? That's what it really hit me. Like, am I going to be like my dad? Am I going to have that? Is it going to pop up uh, sometime throughout my life? I was very scared of that, yeah. As an adult, Conrad battled depression and alcohol until one day a cousin reached out to help. My cousin Shireen is a social worker. She invited me to a workshop. I invited Conrad to attend the mental health first aid training at the Recovery Education Institute, and he absolutely loved it. The REI instructor helped Conrad understand how schizophrenia affects people. That made me feel so uh, close, closer to my dad than I ever, ever had, because then I understood what he was going through. Um, and I think that that's where my eyes opened up. We didn't understand as children about mental health, but we saw a lot of the behaviors, and then to have it explained when we're adults, it, it made us be able to look back and, and know why things happened the way that they did. My perspective changed totally. I, I actually got emotional because I was like, this is amazing. This is amazing what it could do for people. It made me feel like I wasn't alone. Gosh, it was great. He developed a fascination with mental health care and saw a new path for himself. And our role is to provide academic support to those impacted by mental health or substance use to be able to work in a meaningful role in the behavioral health field. Conrad trained to be a peer partner and now supervises others. He's turned mental health care into a full-time profession. Now I know that by helping others, you help yourself. Um, that took a while and for me to learn. A lot of people feel shame about addiction or mental illness um, and are afraid to talk about it. So it's kind of like rebranding your identity, flipping it into uh, something that becomes an opportunity for growth. We understand what it feels like to struggle but we also understand what it feels like to find hope. And the purpose of our program, more than anything else, is to empower and to give hope to those who are ready and willing and want that lifeline. Before I was uh, unable to be honest with myself, and now that's all I want to do is be, just put it out there. So I believe I was uh, meant to do this work. And seeing him doing that day to day, is amazing. That's what REI is about.